Hi guys, it's me again. Yep, I have my foundation on and uh, all I need now is some eye makeup, some blush and some lipstick and I'm ready to hit that down. Yes, I am. Don't I look amazing? Well, thanks. <laughs> I know I'm going to get loads of comments about this, but my um, foundation is so natural looking. It actually matches my skin tone. So I did a really good job. Anyway, guys, that's it. Just wanted to show you my own homemade foundation. Now, let's be serious. I actually made a little concoction of my own using some household uh, stuff that you would have in your kitchen. First thing I did use was, it is um, it's pure cold pressed organic avocado oil. Bought it out of the supermarket. Obviously, um, I bought uh, extra virgin olive oil, which I have in my kitchen anyway, you know everybody has it. So I used a spoon, tablespoon of this, tablespoon of this, and I mixed it with no other than red paint. No, seriously. I mixed it with um, Termic. Now, normally I do have the Termic powder, but unfortunately I did run out, so I had to use my tablets and I used, I opened up three of them and poured them into a bowl. And um, this is what I got. And because everything is pure natural, I did paint all over my face. I don't know if you noticed, but I did. Painted it all over my face. And now I'm going to wait for 20 minutes to see if it's hydrated me, to see if my skin looks lovely and luscious. Or when I wash it off, Am I still going to look like a Numpa Loompa? No. Hmm. That remains to be seen. So, we'll wait 20 minutes. I'll wash it off my face. I'll come back and um, if I'm still this colour, this video will not go out. But anyway, guys, we'll see. Here I go again. I'm trying to turn off this computer. Look at me eyes. <laughs> Pure rubbish of this. Anyway, I will get better eventually. Or... I learned to edit. Yes, learned to edit. Mm. That's me, I'm back. And obviously I'm not orange anymore. Now, because these products, the um, the avocado oil, 100% pure cold press avocado oil, it's all natural. And of course my um, extra virgin olive oil and my tiramic, because they are all so natural, you can actually apply them under, straight under the eye and on the top of the eye. But when you do on the top of the eye, use it very, very sparingly. Do not use it on the eyelids because the oils and the turmeric will, and the turmeric is quite grainy, it will seep into your eyes and cause a bit of irritation. So we don't want that. So just sort of a, if you want to avoid this area, do. And just do it all round here. And uh, I've just washed my face. I did wash it with 100% um, free, uh, soap free, sorry, soap free um, face wash. And that's the one I did on my aldehol. Uh, it's from La Cura. And I washed my face with that. And to be honest with you, normally when I wash my face, do you know what, when it feels tight and dry, it doesn't. Now, um, I do have a picture before I started, before I painted my face orange. Uh, it, I don't know, I think my skin, well, it feels softer. And uh, I'll, put a wee, I'll put a wee picture up, the before, and I'm going to actually use this for a, a short time, and then I'll get back to you and tell you, does it actually work? Because you do see a lot of uh, YouTubers doing videos on stuff you have in your kitchen, and do they work? And I definitely know the one with the lemon and the baking soda for your teeth, works but not to be used too often it works by god when you're finished with it your teeth feel brilliant i might do a wee video about that but it's kind of been done today so maybe i won't but anyway we'll see how this works after maybe a week and i'll get back to you i've still got a wee bit there uh, i'll get back to you and to see if there's any difference in my skin who knows i don't know but uh We'll try it out anyway. And uh, guys, the same old story. If you like my channel, please like and subscribe. It does mean the world to me. And uh, to all the people who have already subscribed to me, 
a lot of them are not just subscribers, but are friends. That's what happens when you're a small channel. You become friends rather than subscribing to each other. Anyway, guys, love you all. Hi to all my subscribers. Love you to death. And thank you for your loyalty. And I do love you all. So take care of yourselves and uh, talk to you later. Bye.